Hey guys, my name is Dan Salvato. Some of you in the Smash community may know me as Internet Explorer. And today I'm going to demonstrate the first proof of concept of the Melee 20XX pack running on an unmodified console. So what I do is I use an exploit in Melee's game code uh, that allows me to run my own code that's loaded as a name tag from the memory card. Uh, the exploit's similar to how you can load Project M by going to the stage builder in Brawl. What my custom function does is it injects the gecko code handler into the system, as well as a gecko code file. By doing this, I can take literally any gecko code for Melee and run it on an unmodified console. Literally anything. So codes for debug menu, widescreen, training related codes, uh, you know, freezing stage transformations, whatever I want, I can basically just copy and paste into my game file. Uh, we start the exploit by going to the name entry screen in versus mode. Uh, when I select name entry, the exploit triggers, and the gecko code handler gets injected. Uh, I also run some other code. So here, the game asked me to create a new game file. This is because the 20xx pack uses a separate game file from the one that's already on the system. Uh, because the existing file is the one with the exploit installed, and so I need to make sure that the 20xx game file doesn't overwrite the save data with the exploit. So let's create this game data. At which point we're taken back to the title screen. Now that extremely satisfying noise tells you that the exploit was successful and the gecko codes are working. And of course I got the Kirby Hat 5 trophy because a couple of the codes that I run are to unlock all the characters and stages. As you can see here. Um, I also use a code to set the default tournament settings, which explains the 4 stock. Um, and I also, for this demonstration, have a code that allows your character to flash white on L cancel, which I'll demonstrate now. <clears throat> so there you go. Uh, so far this is just a proof of concept, so we don't have a release yet, but I hope to work closely with Achilles to port the best features of the 20xx pack to this exploit. Now the best part about this is, all it takes is one memory card to convert every single setup at a tournament venue to 20xx. This could be a huge game changer, with codes enabling new competitive considerations, such as playing on Pokemon Stadium without the stage transformations. <laughs> now when it's released, anyone with a homebrew Wii can install this mod onto the memory card with no hassle. But it gets better than that. You can even copy the file to other memory cards using the standard file copy procedure on a GameCube or Wii. That's how easy it will become to hack Melee. Just copy the file from one memory card to the next. So I hope you're excited for the future of this project. Be sure to follow me on Twitter and Twitch for future updates and releases. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope to see you around.